Hello everybody, it's Craft and Just Because with Chris Cowan. And I'm just getting set up here. So we are using the Friends of Life um, bundle. It has dies and a stamp set. And then it's got this beautiful Full of Life Designer Series paper. I'm going to be using these pieces in particular um, to pull in the greens and the blues. And I'm going to use Granny Apple Green and Blueberry Bushel for this. So let's first cut our pieces because then we need to do some die cutting and then stamping. Okay. Whoops. I apologize for that, you guys. Okay. So we first want to bring in our paper trimmer. <coughs> and I need a card base. Whoops. That is four and a quarter. By 11 and we are going to score that in half to make it a regular card at five and a half on the 11 inch side then I need a piece of designer series paper and I'm cutting this at four and one eighth by five and three eighths Okay. I'm going to use this little scrap for um, some die cutting, so I'm going to go ahead and keep that out. And then I also want to cut a piece um, oh, of the Granny Apple Green that is a three by three. Oops. Okay, and then I also want another piece that is two inches by five and a quarter inches, or sorry, I didn't mean five and a quarter, I meant five and a half, so that's perfect. And then I'm going to take this piece and I want to cut a piece um, that is two and seven eighths by two and seven eighths okay and then with the remaining piece i also want to cut this at one and seven eighths by five and a half okay So that is all of our cutting on our um, on our paper trimmer. Now let's do a little bit of die cutting. And the first thing I want to die cut is um, this full heart. right here and we are going to put that in the center of our three by three granny apple green piece okay and I'm going to use post-it tape just to hold it in place because I kind of want it centered in that square as best as I can So we're going to go ahead and die cut that out. Oh, let's do this while we're doing it. And then I have that other little piece. Um, and I'm going to die cut out the big hearts. And then on that little skinny piece of designer series paper, we're going to die cut out those smaller hearts. Let me get rid of 
my leaves here. Okay. Want that. And then now we just need to do the smaller leaves and then we can stamp our image. Or not smaller leaves, the smaller hearts. Right. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Okay. So now we're done with our die cutting. Let's put all of that away. Let's get the dies back on their sheet there. And then let's go ahead. Whoops. I'm gonna go ahead and clean up my area real quick. Okay, so then I'm going to take my blueberry bushel and this piece, and right here, I want to stamp high. Just gonna stamp that right on down just like that let that dry for just a moment let's go ahead and glue our hearts layers so that those can dry while we assemble our card hearts and I'm going to just glue them in the center of the bigger hearts There's that. Then we're gonna take our layers here. So let's first fold our card base in half. Then I'm gonna do this piece. And we'll center that on down. And then these two pieces will layer on top of each other. Okay, and it's gonna go down the center just like that. Okay. 
then this is going to get glued behind the heart. So you're just going to put a thin layer of glue all around. Okay. And then I want to put that on dimensionals. And then we're going to take our sticky back or our release paper off. Oops. And then I'm just going to center this right on down into the middle. And I'm going to glue down my hearts. And that's our card today, you guys. Super simple, but lots of layers. And I love that it used stamping our um, cut and emboss dies and the designer series paper. So I think there's a lot of possibilities with this stamp set. Um, I think it's really, really pretty and um, I had fun creating with it. So until next time, my creative peeps, I will see you later. Oh, one thing I wanted to mention is Friday, or sorry, not Friday, Wednesday, I will be doing my live at one o'clock because um, I have somewhere to go after work. So the rest of the week will be after work and Wednesday will be at one o'clock. I hope you have a great night. And until next time, I will see you later, my friends. Bye-bye.